Welcome to my channel, Connection of Lives and Interests. This is Sharon coming to you with Mr. Thumbs Up, whose hair is getting long, but he's going to cut it before his mom comes. <laughs> and here's his update of projects on his 1955 Chevy 210 four-door that we bought the end of November. What are you up to, Mr. Thumbs Up? Well, these are the bumper guards on the back that I showed you in another video. Um... And it's pretty rusty in there. So what I did was I cleaned it out as good as I could. And I put pour 15 on the back side of this bracket. It was really rusty and there's no way for me to get any paint in there. I just took the pour 15 and mushed it in there. Oh, you didn't use the sponge that I yeah, gave you? Yeah, I used the sponge thing and I had to get my fingers in there and with gloves. Right. <laughs> So there is some pour 15 on the bumper guard itself in there, only because I figured the spray paint won't get way down in there. Oh yeah. So the rest of it tomorrow probably will be um, spray painted, and he, primer and paint. He masked it off really good. Yeah, the chrome is really good on this car. It's amazing how the backside can get rusty. Right. That's crazy. So fast. And so I finished these. Look at how beauteous that is. I mean, it's just the inside, so. Yeah. But it's very shiny. I hope it's coming through to you as well as it really is. And then there's and the inside the other, of that one. These are the two outer corners of the rear bumper. And I already did the other center piece. And you can't get them mixed up. They're the same? Or are they different? They're different. Yeah. So you know which one's which? Yeah. So over here I got some more bracket. So what oh, is... Do I know which one's which? No, not yet. <laughs> <laughs> so these are brackets for the bumpers as well. And I cleaned up, cleaned them up and... Ooh, nice and shiny. Did the pour 15 on there. And so, that's it. And what does your wife call that stuff? Pour 15. Yeah, so every time he says it, I still hear 415. But, poor. but just today, he Everybody told me it's, what it is. it's poor 15, and it stands for paint, paint over rust. Yeah. <laughs> <It's good TV. laughs> so if you like this video, we hope you'll give us a thumbs up. We've got all the videos of this 1955 Chevy 210 four-door in a playlist for you all to watch we're up to over 20 videos now mr thumbs up can you believe it and that's not even covering all the projects I one more thing that he has done because i was either sick or busy so i miss some stuff like him taking out the the back seats of the car and then uh i had to help him with the front seats so we didn't so this Film rubber that. piece looks like a belt. Goes between the car and the bumper, and it fits in a little groove. And this thing was totally full of paint. They painted it. So I'm like, how am I gonna get the paint off of this? Wow! So I went to YouTube, and one guy said you can actually sand it, sand it off. And so I tried that, and I'm like, well, some of the paint's pretty thick. I just started wire brushing it with one of those small wire brushes. It took me about an hour to get all the paint off of the wire brush. Are you talking about... And then I used silicone spray to keep cleaning it and cleaning it and cleaning it. And it came out like brand new. Nice. It does look like you just bought it. It's like brand new. And what's that for? goes between the bumper itself and the car. Oh, that's cool. It fits cool. in a little groove. So the wire brush, are you talking about the toothbrush looking kind yeah. of wire brush? Yeah, the small ones, yeah. Oh, cool. Well, you did a fantastic job and I know others will agree. Yeah, the silicone spray. Oh man, it came out nice. So there's a tip for you all that have projects that need to clean stuff up. All right. We That's it. 
Thank you for watching. We hope you give us a, a thumbs up if you like our videos. And you'll join our channel by subscribing. And hit that bell. <laughs> so you don't miss any upcoming notifications. Because you never know what I might share next. And for those of you that are new here watching, this is a 55 Chevy that he bought November 29th, 2023. All right. So watch the playlist. We've got it all on there. Be kind. Be nice. Be encouraging. No matter where you are through the internet, we can touch lives. We can make a difference. We can make people smile, laugh, and give encouraging words. And remember... Keep the fun in all you do. Isn't she a beauty? We think we have a name, but we're not totally written in ink on that one yet. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Bye.